No. You once told me not to let you off the hook. Confess to me that Rosalind Dyer's case stopped you from being there for your wife when she was dying. Now I know that was a lie. A lie you told yourself because the truth was too painful. What's the truth? You're a coward. You weren't there for Rebecca because you were too weak to watch her suffer. So you blame the job. Same way you blame your debts for becoming a criminal and a murderer. It doesn't matter that you fell down. Everybody falls down. What matters is what comes next. Do you make it right, or do you just make it worse? You know your problem, John. You think you're better than people. No, just you. Now get on the floor, arms out. Here's the thing. I, I knew you were on to me this morning, that whole wild goose chase. So I spent the day preparing for the worst. Last time I ask, get on the damn ground. You were friends with Aaron. Hell, I found video of the two of you conspiring outside a bar the other night. Turns out Serge recruited you the same time as Aaron, paid you serious money to funnel police files to him. No one's gonna believe that. Yeah, they will. Because I won't be the only one saying it. There's another cop on our payroll. John Nolan. Which brings us to this moment. You broke into my house to kill me because I found out you were dirty. But I killed you in self-defense. <laughs> I wouldn't do that. Control, this is Officer Nolan. You don't have time for that, John. You gotta go, or they're gonna find it. Find what? The evidence in your house. 